Welcome back, fight fans. We are back here at Air Canada Center in lovely Toronto, Canada for our first fight of the night. Perhaps one of the most hyped up undercard fights in recent memory. It's going to take place here at RZ FC 36. Our first fighter coming down to the octagon currently being checked out by the doctors. Blade Harris, 8-1 amateur kickboxing record. He'll make his MMA debut tonight after being signed recently to an RZFC contract. A lot of fans coming in from Las Vegas to support their guy, Blade Harris. He offers a plethora of deadly kicks, punches, and knees. We'll see how his opponent can handle it. And speaking of his opponent, this Toronto crowd is going to let you hear it for him. Native of Toronto, Canada, coming home for his MMA debut. Former OCW champion, that's right, professional wrestler A.C. Cobra. Cobra and his crew coming out. Listen to this crowd for Cobra. They love him. They cannot get enough. He's making his way out after probably one of the toughest six months of his career. As I mentioned before, Cobra comes from a professional wrestling background. Very, very strategic grappler. And he spent a lot of time working on a stand-up game since signing the MMA contract in June. And Cobra coming up the stairs for the first time. The crowd cannot get enough. A lot of fans from all over the world tuning in to see how Cobra fares in the octagon. He's going to take a jog around the octagon here. Oh, a little trash talk to Harris. And with that... Both fighters excited will take you to our tale of the tape. Professional wrestler AC Cobra is Harris's junior by three years. He also has a five inch height advantage and a five inch reach advantage. Let's take you to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC light heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 200 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, Harris! And now we're producing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a grappler, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Toronto, Ontario, Canada, the Cobra! And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Mario Yamasaki. And with Mario Yamasaki's cue, this debut is on. The gloves touch as Harris and Cobra look to square off. Cobra coming with a quick flurry of hits. Harris had to take a step back, but he fires away on his own. Cobra's got to be careful being this aggressive with an experienced kickboxer like Harris. It's damaged. It doesn't look like he's doing too much damage to Harris. Harris just kind of sucking these punches in after that initial flurry. Being very patient here is Harris. A couple of kicks. Nice flurry there. I'll be interested to see if Cobra takes this to the ground and tries to employ some of his strategy. As Cobra looks to take an early lead, he's being very aggressive again. Harris just kind of sucking these punches in as we approach the four and a half minute mark in the round. Oh, a lot of damaging leg kicks there from Blade Harris. Both these fighters staying on their feet as of right now. Cobra holding his own, and this is a good sign if you're a fan of AC Cobra. Blade Harris hits him with a kick straight out of Muay Thai. Connects with an uppercut right after that. And this is what I've talked about. Cobra's got to be careful here. He could, he could get knocked down at any minute. His punches don't seem to be doing that much damage. And Harris with another face kick. One wrong move from AC. Cobra! And he could be on his way to the mat. He's going to back it up. It looks bad for Cobra. Oh, it shakes him off. No grappling coming from Blade. Harris and another head kick sends him to the mat. Cobra's got to get on his feet, and he does. No stoppage from Mario Yamasaki. Harris looking to put the fight away. Just a minute and a half into it. Cobra looks lost. He can't he can't fully land these strikes. He's got to put some more got to put some more heat behind him. Jabs are not going to take down this behemoth. Oh, a missed deadly kick there from Blade Harris and he lands another jab. Harris just biding his time waiting for the perfect moment. Cobra hit again. The one two, but he won't give it up. Cobra staying on his feet after being knocked down a second time in 2 minutes. Harris again, he backing away, just waiting for the perfect moment. Cobra, oh, he's hit again. 
Another head kick and Cobra, he doesn't know where he is. He thinks he's in the wrestling ring and I don't know if the ref should allow this to go on anymore. Cobra, he's going to try to fight back and keep it going, trying to avoid a stoppage. That cut on his eye is brutal and it's only going to get worse unless he can put his gloves up and stop these head kicks. Harris, another big flurry. Watch that body trying to take the stamina out of Cobra, trying to wait for that knockdown. Cobra just can't land anything. He's just throwing into the gloves and just taking a brutal counter. Again, dodges everywhere. He's down again. Cobra looking to finish this fight. Harris trying to take him down again. Another hand doesn't really land. Not doing too much damage, Harris. Backs away again. He's trying to see an opening. Good dodge there from Cobra. Three knockdowns. You got to give it up for the professional wrestler. He is not giving in. He wanted to make this, this jump into the octagon, and he's holding his own against a professional kickboxer right now. Blade Harris, another front kick. He's looking to put it away. He survived three minutes into the first round. I don't know how much longer that's going to last unless he can do some damage to his opponent. Blade Harris with a straight punch right to the head. And another straight punch is going to send him reeling. Cobra light on his feet. And here he goes. A punch to the nose, and the ref is going to call it. Too many shots to the face of Cobra, and there is blood all over his opponent. Let's take a look at this again. Cobra just won't put his hands up, and that purple hair goes flying everywhere. The fans, shocked. Blood spilling from the mouth, the eyes, and the nose of AC Cobra. What has he gotten himself into? Blade Harris with a successful debut. Crowd doesn't seem jacked up about it, but he sure is. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is called to stop to this contest at three minutes, 16 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by And Blade Harris is officially 1-0 in his MMA career. Very disappointing loss for AC Cobra there, but he's going to look to bounce back. I, I don't know. I don't know if he can make it in this industry, but only time will tell. I'll tell you one thing: if he wants to have success in this octagon, he's going to have to do more than throw snap jabs. <laughs>